up you guys welcome to the video today is a very big day for us so we are going to be taking on Fran for the first time ever this is one of the most popular CrossFit workouts if you're not familiar do you want to explain to them what Fran is so you got 21 reps 15 reps 9 reps so it's three uh, one round of 21 15 9 and it's gonna be thrusters at 95 pounds mm -hmm. and uh, pull-ups yep so 21 thrusters, 21 pull-ups, 15 thrusters, 15 pull-ups, nine, pull nine thrusters, nine pull-ups. It's very simple, but it is one of the most infamous CrossFit workouts. And uh, as you guys know, I've been doing CrossFit for about three months. john has been doing it for about four months. Um, so this is gonna be our first taste of it. I was honestly like not expecting to be doing this workout today. And when I saw that it was programmed, I was thinking to myself, well, I have not prepared for this correctly. And like, I'm not sure if I wanna film a video, I'm not sure, but I feel like being honest and like open with you guys is the best way to go about it. Yeah. So. I'm just, just excited. Yeah. I'm excited. Yeah. Let's just do it. Sorry. Your hands are all chalky, man. My goal was to get sub 10 minutes and I got nine minutes and one second and also a very, very bloody hand that's hurting more and more every single second that passes. Oh. I also dropped the bar and it almost broke my camera. It's been about 10 minutes since the workout. I cleaned off my hand. It's really not that bad. It just looks a lot worse because all the blood because you know, you're not going to stop mid-workout to clean it but I'm going to cut off this this skin and then wrap it up. It should be fine in a couple days. So.
So it has actually been a few days since that workout and uh, my hand is healing up quite perfectly. It looked a lot worse with the blood and everything. It really wasn't that bad. But I did just kind of want to give my final thoughts on how I felt the workout went and just, you know, maybe some tips for people that might be trying it out for the first time. So for me personally, I know that my biggest limiting factor and something that I thought was better but I apparently just wasn't that good yet was my front rack position so when you're doing a thruster you have to basically get into a front squat and you have to be able to get your elbows really high and that's just something that I thought I had better mobility with and maybe that was just a bad day for me but I definitely was not doing that correctly and that was definitely hindering me a ton like it sucks because the 95 pounds really wasn't that heavy for me and like I don't think that the weight was the main thing or even my like cardiovascular system it was literally just like the pain in my wrist not being able to get in the front rack position perfectly and like, you know, kind of compensating for that. Um, so that was definitely the thing that I was really the most bummed about. Obviously, if I was better at pull-ups and I was able to get those unbroken, I would have gotten a much better time. Um, but overall, I'm really happy with how it went. Like my goal was to get under 10 minutes and I was able to do that. Did, did it look great? Absolutely not. Um, am I proud of myself? Yes. And you know, I, I'm sure there's gonna be a lot of people that are on this video that don't like CrossFit. They're gonna be saying a bunch of stuff and that's totally fine. Like you're more than welcome to have your opinion. But I know for me, personally like I went in today looking to have an experience or not today but that workout uh, it was like two days ago I went in looking to have an experience and just you know try my hardest on that workout and that's exactly what I did I had a great experience it taught me a lot about myself and what things that I need to work on but I'm really glad that I did it and I can't wait to do it again and I know that sounds crazy but I really can't wait to do it again and hopefully just improve on that time a ton before I do that though there are a lot of things I'm gonna be working on mainly is my mobility working on that front rack getting able to be able to get in that front rack when I'm doing that front squat so it's not as unstable as it was but yeah I'm really happy with how everything went if you are gonna try that workout out you know just make sure that you practice your mobility make sure that you're you're able to do thrusters fine and it's not an issue there's no pain or anything like that and then obviously work on your pull-ups but yeah, I'm really happy that I was able to do that workout. I was happy I was able to bring it uh, to you guys. And thank you guys so much for watching. If you got to this point, I really appreciate it because this is the very end of the video. So thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. There was one other thing that I wanted to say. Oh yeah, look up my fam! Uh. <laughs> yeah, so it's mainly cut off. Most of it's cut off now. Obey the warning signs. And when there are flashing lights or wigwags, don't attempt to cross until they come to a complete stop.